South Africa will hold national and provincial elections on May 29th, coinciding with the celebration of the country's 30 years of freedom. President Sigi Ramaphosa's office said he had met with the country's nine premiers and the Independent Electoral Commission to discuss preparations for the general elections. Sigi Ramaphosa is seeking a second term as president. He has struggled to significantly boost economic growth since taking over from Jacob Zuma as president in 2018. Several polls predict that the party once widely admired across the world and led by Nelson Mandela will slip below 50% of the vote for the first time since it won South Africa's first all-race elections in 1994 to usher a new democracy following the end of a white minority rule. If it loses its majority, the ANC would have to form a coalition to stay in power. Its main rivals are the Democratic Alliance, the second largest party in the parliament, and the Economic Freedom Fighters, the third largest, both of which have launched their election manifestos. South Africans will elect a new National Assembly and provincial legislatures in each of the country's nine provinces before the National Assembly elects the new president. The vote will be South Africa's seventh fully democratic election and is expected to be the most competitive since the end of the apartheid system.